family. Welcome to the channel, you beautiful people. I hope you guys are having yourself a wonderful day. In today's video, guys, we'll be reacting to a video from uh, Gaza, Palestine by uh, Abdullah Onaim Daily. The video was suggested by Farhan Akmal. Thank you very much for your suggestion. The link is, guys, in the description in case you guys wanted to check it out. So, without uh, further ado, now let's get started with our video. <laughs> Dua rudal dijatuhkan, dua rudal dijatuh, dua rudal dijatuhkan oleh pihak Israel dan semoga tidak ada korban ini karena memang sudah lima hari resiko wilayah jalur Gaza sudah ke seratus tiga. Wow, so this is, uh, I guess, uh, close to an area where the uh, a missile was dropped. Look at this, Hong. <coughs> setelah uh, agresi dua menit setelah pihak Israel menjatuhkan rudal saya berada di sini dan ini tepatnya di Gaza City berdekatan dengan rumah sakit Ashifa berdekatan dengan masjid yang merupakan rumah sakit Ashifa dan saat ini para warga dan juga uh, pertemuan situ Oh man, this needs to be shared guys, the world needs to see what's going on in Palestine and in Gaza and West Bank and what uh, Israel is doing to these uh, innocent people. Wow, another one, another bomb. Okay, that's fine. Well. Children, women and children are getting massacred. In the name of defense, we have the right to defend ourselves. But those who we occupy have no right. The only way this will stop is through sanctions and making sure you don't buy any product that's made in Israel. Israel is the only country that can drop bomb and destroy 
media buildings without anybody saying anything. This is occupation, this is genocide, this is war crimes. This is apartheid, this is everything. Locked out millions of people in an open air prison. They cannot leave. They cannot import product to build their homes. And then missiles are dropped on top of them. If they try to defend themselves, they're called terrorists. SubhanAllah. What a world do we live in, eh? Where your home is given to somebody else. And if you try to defend yourself because somebody's trying to steal your land, kill your family, you're called a terrorist. Spawner, what's crazy and people don't realize is that during the 1900s, early 1900s, like 1901, 1902, there was no country such as Israel. The country that was there at that part of the world, it was called Palestine. So I'm not sure, you know, it's just uh, crazy. It's, it's crazy, the small that for decades, 70 years now, you know, Palestinians have been going through this, losing their life, losing their land, being oppressed, being occupied going through genocide, going through criminality that's been taking place and testing of weaponry on their people. We need to make sure whatever we can do to share all these videos about Palestine and flood YouTube as well as all you uh, social media platforms to let the world know because I'm pretty sure there are Israeli trolls that will do the same and put propaganda and false information so we need to ensure that the truth gets out there so guys please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe to the channel i truly appreciate you guys' love and support i hope you guys have yourself a wonderful day and inshallah i'll see you guys in the next video take care